interested in, of course, is Boston Garden. Mark Cooper is there with an update on uh, tonight's opening game between the Sabres and the Bruins. Before we go to that, let's have uh, this update. More than any other Sabre, Barrasso was the man in the spotlight in this series. The team's hopes ride largely on his performance. I equate the goaltending in playoff to uh, the starting pitching in baseball in a World Series. If you get it, you're going to be in the series. If not, it's going to make it for a long series. And Tom Barrasso is certainly our candidate for the Vesna. He was outstanding during the regular season. We have no reason to believe that he won't show that same form in the playoffs. The Bruins will start Reggie Lemelin in the first game tonight, but Coach Terry O'Reilly says he has no qualms about going with Andy Moog should the need arise. They both have been playing outstanding hockey for us, but uh, Reggie has has been largely responsible for our success this year, and he's playing right now uh, at the top of his game. And, uh, it was a question of him really uh, deserving the first playoff game, but I have no qualms about playing either one of them at any point. One other key aspect of this matchup, the Sabres have 14 young players who will be appearing in their first Stanley Cup playoff game tonight. It's a good feeling, but there's a lot of nervous just going around uh, the younger guys and uh, we know that uh, playoff hockey is uh, you know the best hockey uh, you know right now and uh, we're gonna have to go out and uh, you know do what we've done all year long and uh, hopefully the young guys can uh, you know adjust to the pressure and uh, do well and we'll have a live report from mark cooper on tonight's game tonight at uh, 11.